have done the reset. I'm starting it. Release it in the 4x2. There it goes. See, it's going to do a gauge test first. Kind of sweeps through the gauges. the reset button to continue through all the different tests. The telltale test that opens up. That little beep that you just heard is my DVR. It's got nothing to do with the test. That shows you all your dash lights. Uh, I guess these are all stuff that if you're an engineer to the truck you'll understand. There's some things in here that are useful even if you don't know what these codes mean. So here's your speed readout in miles per hour, kilometers per hour, your tachometer, fuel level, and fuel level too. Uh, I guess that's if you have a second tank. That's your average miles per gallon. Coolant temperature. That's how many times your odometer rolled over. Compass, I guess that's if you have that available in your dash, but this truck doesn't have that. Your voltage is pretty cool. Gives you an instant readout. Uh, this would be a great test for when you're running your truck under load with the battery charge protection mode on or when you uh, you can check your battery voltage with this if you do the same thing without actually starting the vehicle just moving it to on and holding down the reset you can do that too. send a signal to something but these different ports goes back to the original gauge test and that's how you do the get into the engineering mode for uh Ford Super Duty. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter what dashboard you have when you do it. Uh, mine's a 2012 F250. Uh, maybe you'll get more information if you got one of those fancy dashboards.